thing, and then there's days where I spend like $200. Cause it's gonna be a little hard for me to camp out in South America, cause I don't want too much to be crawling up on me. <laughs> You know, and I'm just like, is this portion of Panama? You can't tell me it's not. No, I'm, you know. know. Yeah, you can't tell me. I'm not camping tell. everywhere. Yeah, so were they uh, camping sites? Or you just off the grid camping out? And we found the Lake El, El Ramante uh -huh. in uh, Guatemala. Mm -hmm. um, it was awesome. Not too bad. So the other thing is you have a whole network when you're down there. That's true. So you got other bikers. Everybody's yeah. doing the same thing. Yeah. So everyone's biker friendly. Okay. And then you have... Also, the overlanders, so mm -hmm. there are people in the um, bands mm -hmm. doing the exact same thing, just living off the grid. That's true. Yeah, that's true. So you you kind of get in packs. Okay. So so, fifteen grand. We'll say we'll say probably give yourself. Is it safe to say give yourself five weeks? Five weeks. You think you can do that back? I could do it in a lot less time. Yeah, but, but I'm saying. To, what do you want to get out of but it? But I'm saying to enjoy the trip, to enjoy the experience, and the, the time travel. Six weeks, maybe. I, there's places I didn't get to go. Oh, so oh, okay. okay. And I was there so, for almost three months. So the goal, if the goal is to hit the tip. You can do that uh, in do probably that. six weeks. Six weeks. Probably okay. maybe even less. Like some okay. I think Greg Rice did an iron but from um, Texas to Panama. And I think it might have been five or seven days or something. Mm -hmm. I don't. Know, I remember how many days, but that's that part took us two weeks. Well, I'm, I'm gonna do the. Uh, I, I'm looking at the uh, the old man likes to enjoy himself version. Of that. So <laughs> yeah. So it would probably be more for a person like me. If you're trying to enjoy yourself, two and a half take months, your time at least. About two and a half months. Okay, so that, that's assuming you don't have any problems. Yeah, and I'm, I'm, I'm getting up on that one. So the next one is obviously the type of bike I'm going to take down there is a Pan American bike or BMW. Some of the yeah, adventure bikes. Yeah, there's a lot of BMWs mm -hmm. out there. There's. Um, all kinds of bikes out yeah. there, but uh, very few Harleys. But a road glide is not probably something you want to you be know, taking out there. I wouldn't take it there. Yeah. Um, but there is a guy. Uh, he's a Hokahe Fed Fetty mm -hmm. who took his Ultra Classic. I think it's a 2007 Ultra Classic, and he did the whole thing. I just don't want to do it. I, I, I personally I would, would not with, do with, it. With knobby tires or uh, enduro type tires, I wouldn't want to do it. Just I, I personally wouldn't do it. Wow. Well, I appreciate you. This was a this was a very exciting conversation. I hope we can have more because I think this type of stuff is what brings the best out of us in motorcycles. It gives us things to see, adventures to take because there's so much to it that we still hadn't touched. Yeah, you're making me think I need to go back and kind of relive <laughs> it seriously. You do. To you do. Because while you're in the moment, you just, you just every day is something new. So you yeah. don't really have time to reflect on it. And since I've been back, I've just been running, 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 running. Well, so. let's, let's make a deal in, in, the, in the future, near future, when you settle down, get back home, get comfortable. Let's talk about it. Let's pick a day and let's go live. And let's say we'll give ourselves 90 minutes. Yeah. We're going to be at least 90 minutes. And we're going to go 90 minutes of so some coffee. And we're going to talk about from the beginning to the tip to back how do we do it the good yep. the bad the, the ugly and we're going to bring the viewers through this experience through this I think that's beautiful great. experience i'm so excited i'm ready to do it let's do it so whatever you do it so for thank thank everybody who's tuning in to catch this video today we appreciate you guys we, we appreciate Cynthia for sharing her adventure with us today but i'm telling you guys hang out there's more to see there's more to hear so this is what this is what it's all about motorcycle and we got a true legend with us today thank you so much for spending time thank you today. very thank much you. <laughs> hey man y'all keep it motorcycle you dig